listen to you. Happy Tuesday. I'm headed to the workhouse, y'all. I'm headed to the workhouse. Praise the Lord. For who you are. It's gloomy and doomy here. It's gloomy and doomy. It's rain. It's rain all day yesterday. And it's raining today. It looked like this morning. It wasn't even in the forecast. But hey, you know how they go too. Anyway. <clears throat> Getting on down. How y'all doing this fine Tuesday morning? What y'all going? Y'all going to work this morning? Come on, go to work with me. Come on, go to work with me. You like me? Are y'all off this week with your children for Thanksgiving? Are you visiting your family? Are you traveling? For the holidays, are people traveling to you? I got to go pick up a um. I got to go pick up a um. Uh, order from Target this afternoon when I get off work and I need to go by the um, Department of Motor Vehicles and get my darn tags renewed. You know I told you I tried to get them done back in September and they wouldn't let me. So I had to wait till, until October and I never even go in October so and now it's due. So I'm going to get my little happy tail towards there and go and get my tags this fine day. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Well, traffic light, I guess it's because, well, I guess that caught people are actually off. I have a couple of friends that actually, their plant closes at Christmas for a week. One of them closed for 10 days. And uh, the other, my other friend, they closed for a week. Everybody's off that week. So, <clears throat> are y'all in that situation where you work for a company that does that? Our company don't do that. You can take, you can take your vacation time. <laughs> But I'm not taking no time off at Christmas either. I might take a day uh, if I take some, you know, because we, like I said, we got Thanksgiving off and then we're going to have Christmas off and then we're going to turn around and I have New Year's Day off. So, and just for me to hang at the house, ain't no need to be just taking no time off unnecessarily. I ain't doing no major shopping. I do want to, I got a couple of things I got to buy on Black Friday. Uh, my friend showed me this thing when she was here, and I said I wait to Black Friday to see if they had it on sale. Uh, I'm gonna get one for my car and for Amber's car. This street, no, it's regular. Let me fix this back here. Oh, child! I'm gonna get one of them things like an emergency where you can jump your battery. You can. Uh, it has an air, um, air compression thing on an emergency flashlight, something else it has on it. Oh, your emergency charger, you just keep it charged up. So I said I was gonna get one for us to have in our vehicles in the event, you know, because people don't hardly want to give you a charger. And when I used to have battery cables in my car, I don't know what happened to them. They came up uh, missing. So uh, I don't have any anymore. So, you know, when something happened, you have to depend on somebody else. Of course you can call AAA, but if you had that thing there yourself, you can go ahead and try to do what you gotta do to get your battery going if you have to. You know, because you ask people, and I mean, people are reluctant to help you now. Men, men, women, everybody, you know. But anyway, you know, I get it. I understand. I do understand. Every time I get in my car, I hear this, oh, I hear this radio, 411 pain. Call 1-100-411 pain. They done made that a gospel song. Oh, have mercy. <laughs> One four one one pain call one eight hundred four one one pain. <laughs> oh, Y'all know I'm silly. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let me get off here, y'all. I'm get my tail on the work. I'll check y'all out this evening. But if not, well, I'm gonna check y'all out this evening anyway when I get off work. But y'all want y'all to have a wonderful and blessed day at work and make it joyful out on purpose. Pour something encouraging to one of your coworkers. They tell them something good. Tell them they look nice today. They smile. Let them do something. But go in with a good morning to them. All right, y'all. I know you probably won't see this till later, so you can always do it on tomorrow. Oh, and by the way, your coworker can be your children, your spouse, right there at your house. All right. I'm at the light, y'all. So I came back home. I know I was gonna tell you. I woke up just nauseous. See, I wake up just nauseous with a nauseous feeling in the morning. 
Sometimes I do. I told y'all I get that all through the day. Sometimes so I always. I had, I, I had a little small piece of watermelon myself. Maybe if I put some on my stomach. But I grabbed these little, few little crackers. I done ate one. I had to grab some crackers to eat. I'm hoping it kind of settled my stomach. So, anyway, what y'all use when y'all have that? What you do? Do you eat crackers like me? <laughs> so you came on back on for that mess. I'm really going to get off here now, y'all, and get my butt to work. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. Wait for you. Safely through. I know the Lord will make a way. Yes, He will. Headed to the well, I ain't headed home. Let me just quit that lie. I'm headed from work because I got to go over to the bank too because I gotta get some money for my tag. And um, because you know, I couldn't get none on Sunday and I worked from home on yesterday, so I got to go by the credit union get me some people. I don't have no cash either. I do like to keep a little cash on me because you just never know. Yeah, that's that for that. I found what I was looking for. Oh, excuse me, y'all. I'm kind of sleepy, man. It's gloomy today. What are these children out here doing? It's a whole gang of them. I don't know where they taking these little happy tea to. If they collecting or what? Nothing else to do. A lot of school when it's gloomy and doomy. Take your tails home. <laughs> I don't know where them children are going. The bitch, you said, mind your own business. Mind your business, ma'am. Mind your business. You just get yourself on back where you going. That's right. But anyway, I had a pretty productive day at work. We had a meeting today. Um, but it wasn't that long. I thought it was going to be a long meeting, but it was pretty quick. So that was good. I was kind of out of it. But it was five of us there today. One of our co-workers is out. The one that runs the Toys for Todd stuff, she had off day. And um, I did go in with the FedEx care stuff and volunteer for one of those days. I told her I would volunteer. And uh, I don't know. I'm going to get there and see what all I'm going to be able to do. She says she'll have something for me to sit down and do some paperwork, checking stuff in and stuff. So we shall see. I said, let me go. We'll be real busy at the first of the month. But since it's five um, Thursdays this month, I'm going to go on the last Thursday and do that Toys for Tots warehouse. And that's the good thing. You can, uh, they let you volunteer during the working hours. So it's not a problem that you want to, they have all type of things you can sign up for. But I particularly told her that I would sign up for the Toys for Tots drive for her because she does that, you know, as she takes on that and she manages the warehouse actually. It's another lady that's over it, but she manages it. And I need to find something. I think I'm just going to donate some cash because I don't want to, um, uh, I don't feel like going to buy nothing. Just, just be honest with you. I don't even feel like fooling with buying no toys. But anyway, that's that for that. Oh, yeah, excuse me. Oh, I am sleepy, man. Anyway, I'm going to get off here because I know y'all took me. I don't want to see me yawning the whole time, but I'll see y'all when, you know, along my little ride. I got to stop at Target and pick up my little pick up the order and I need some stuff from Walmart too. I did some gift bags. I need I guess you say what you need. Not no food items but some gift bags and I ordered some more of that Castile soap uh, my backup uh, peppermint one because I needed another one. You know I told you I ordered one another one and somebody had put in the comments that they used the baby one unscented. So I actually ordered one of those one time uh, one of those to try 
And if I don't like it, I know my daughter will use it. So there's that for that. I shouldn't think of a reason why I didn't like it. That was one I got one time, like a rose one. I used it, but I didn't like it at all. Not at all. I didn't like the scent. It was I don't I don't I'm not a big rose scent fan unless it's just a flower, but you know, for products and stuff. Mm -hmm. It was a no for me, child. It was a big fat no for me. I said I was getting off here, didn't I? Yes, y'all say you always saying that then you just keep on talking. <laughs> y'all used to me by now. Y'all used to me and my foolishness by now. Man, are you gonna let me over? Let me over. They got the road blocked up here. Look like the utility man up here. I couldn't have no job like that when you go up in that uh that crane thing. Mm-mm. That's a no for me. Let me get over y'all. I'm gonna get off here for real. I'll see y'all in a bit. Where would I be? Y'all, I done pulled up here to Target. Look like I done picked a time when there's a whole bunch of people coming. I guess everybody done got off work or whatever. Uh, I did the drive up. I did a pickup, but I did the drive up because I did not want to go in the store because I didn't want to be tempted by nothing up in Target but what I came up in here for. So I'm sitting out here waiting on my order. Welcome to home of the Good Burger. Can I take you? I don't know why that popped in my head, but you know they done got that darn Good Burger meal at Arby's now. I see people getting them. Y'all know I love me a strawberry shake, but I ain't going to get that. I'm just talking, child. I ain't going to get nothing. I'll take a few dollars to get a person. So I'll give them a few dollars for bringing my stuff to the car for me. So appreciate you very much. Thank you very, very, very much. I ordered this morning. It's been ready. But I knew I wasn't going to come until I got off work. So there's that part. That's the cutest little girl in front of me. Anyway, always oh, they be so cute to me. Oh, she's an albino looking girl. You know, they have the blonde hair and the real pale skin. She's cute as she want to be, though. Oh, mama got her dressed so cute. Anyway, oh Lord, child mercy. Y'all, I am sleepy, sleepy. Man, when I get home, I don't know if it's the gloom and doom or the weather or what, but shoot, I'm, I'm glad it's gonna stop raining though. I'm, I'm glad of that. I hope it don't stop it. But my knees and start on the clown when I was walking out the building. And it was like that. The closer I got to the car, the more pain it was. I'm like, wait a minute. And I felt good going in the building. But it done creeped up on me. It done, done, done creeped up on me. It pain. So I'm going to have to set it down down when I get home for sure. For real, for real. Now when people ask you like I went to this little corner store right the other day. And all I got was one piece of chicken. I didn't ask her how much the chicken was. I just one wing is two nineteen. Well ma'am, I didn't ask you how much the wing was. I said, Can I have one wing? <laughs> That's all I wanted. I'm like, Lord have mercy. It's two of them coming out. I wanted one of these more. Y'all, let me get off here because I got to show this uh, code and I'm on my phone today. So I got to show this code and be ready, ready, ready for them. Okay, I'll be right back. Y'all call y'all back. Okay, y'all, I got my little order. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to get on down. I don't know if I did this the most efficient way, but I'm going to whip on over here to the Department of Motor Vehicles. They were pretty quick coming on about it the other day. Two. So... And he go looking like his mama twin. Yeah, I don't know if that's his mama or grandmama, but oh, they definitely got the jeans. They got the jeans to match. The jeans, the jeans. Y'all, you know what? This has been a blessing. Sometimes they be messing up your water and stuff, but you know how much time sometimes you say not to me i don't have a large order so but just think i imagine i was watching um a tribe of many right and she had her grocery pickup i can't even imagine how long it takes her because her, her orders be large large so i can't even imagine how long it takes her in the store because she was talking about how much time what a time saver it was 
to have the um the her you know her order picked up at Sam's and uh, Walmart and stuff. She just have it picked up and people shop for her. And she also she has this stuff delivered from somewhere else. And recently they just got some cows. I'm like, ooh, that's a bit much. But I guess that's part of being self sustaining. She called it. They was getting milk from some farm. But anyway, these new cows, they got a low producing from this farm they was getting the, the milk from. So they're going to have, they bought two. They're going to have their own milk. And so the dad said, well, you know, you can always kill them for beef. And she was like, no, we'll give them away. You know, because they buy cows. But she said, if that don't work out, then the dad was like, go on and kill them. Not the husband, but the, her dad. Her dad. Tell me, go on and kill the cows for beef. I'm like, ooh, child, they really, you know, I think it's great when you can be self-sustained like that because they got chickens and everything. They moved from their house. You know, I guess I'm going to say it was in the city, but they seemed like they were in a uh, rather suburban-like area in the first place. But anyway, they bought this land, which is, is massive from the looks of things, and they kind of getting their stuff together. They got a chicken coop. Like I said, the cows, they're actually building a house out there. So if y'all never check them out, check them out. The tribe of men is a very interesting family. She has 11 kids, so and he's a uh, minister. But anyway, y'all, I'm going to get off here because I'm going to head on over, like I said, to the Department of Motor Vehicles to get my tags and make it do what it do. And I need to take my other um, decal in uh, there also because when I'm in Amber's car and stop me because I leave that one on my window. And when I get in her car, sometimes I have one to take in now and sometimes I go off and leave it in a car and everything else. So it reminds me, one time I left one in the rental car. It's be hard to remember to take them things down sometimes, so. But anyway, I'm going to get off here and I'll talk back to y'all when I get to the DMV. Well, y'all done made it up here to the clerk's office. They get my tags. There's a lot of cars out here, but I don't think they don't normally be that busy. So, I don't think they too busy. I see they got the senior citizen up. Senior, um center up here i wonder uh how what they got going on in that senior center hello sir how are you doing thank yeah. you i got some trash in my hand thank you again he was kind enough to hold the door open for me so, there is that for that. But anyway. Hello, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, thank you. I need to get my tags renewed. And get a replacement for my placard. Okay, y'all, I'm back. That's one of the blessings. Y'all saw how long I stood in line a hot second. And I tell y'all, if I would have been in Memphis still, <laughs> yeah, don't even get me started on that. So I'm back in business. Got my tags and I got my placard. Look at God, won't he do it? Won't he do it, honey? Every time, put that up. I do that when I get home. I put my stick on. Anyway, y'all know where I'm headed now. To my house. To my house, honey. Get myself on. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna drive up on the mailbox, so I don't have to walk back down now. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. I'll call y'all. I'll let y'all see what I got from Target. I ain't getting nothing but a few little items when I get home. But I will see y'all in a minute. Cause I know y'all don't want to take this ride with me. Oh, y'all, I done made it in. Praise the Lord. <laughs> I'm gonna put this uh, target order up. Got me some salt and pepper pistachios. I got me some Lily's gummies. 
They not don't taste. They don't taste like the real ones. They don't taste too bad. I got the sour kind. They 70 calories for this little bag. I'm not out of these, but I went ahead and ordered some more because I had a coupon off the top with the circle. This got me some breakfast sausage because I had to taste them. These are actually the pork kind. These are the Johnsonville. I got me some more of the chicken andouille sausage. Got three of the old snap pickles, the sassy bites. I didn't have a little small bag, so I just got a bag of the simple ruffles. My refill up on my Castillo peppermint. I got some more of these, the cashews. got the Casil, um, the, the baby kind. I said I'm trying. I needed some more magnesium, so I got that. I got some uh, magnesium glycinate and started trying to pick up a couple of things for the crew, so I got me two little things of the Listerine to have because I was I used the rest of it when I traveled, so I just got my last time I traveled. And I've been meaning to get two travel sizes, so I got me two more. I know I need some. I got me some true fruit chocolate covered strawberries. And a thing of hangers. So that was my little quick holly haul, y'all. I had a lot of mail in the mailbox. So I guess that mail I said, if you don't get this mess up out of here, I know something. Anyway, y'all, that's enough of my jibber jabber for today. Y'all, I promise we done been with you long enough with your foolishness today. But anyway, remember I told y'all, have a joyful and blessed day. I washed some, I, well, I threw them in the washing machine before I left for work today. Uh, two of my throws that I use in here. So I'm going to go throw them in the dryer and put this little stuff up. And I'm going to take a half a seat. I'm going to take several seats, as a matter of fact. Um, I ain't got to take several, but one will do. Anyway. Thank y'all for joining me and stop by to see me today. You know you love. I love you. But God truly loves you the most. Remember to always be kind to yourself and others. Be joyful and be blessed. Love y'all and I'll see y'all later on this week. Bye.